Hey everybody, thank you for joining us on another week of Local Insider. I am here today with Judy Tang here at Baja Cali. And did you know Baja Cali now serves breakfast? So thank you for joining us on this week's Local Insider here at Baja Cali. But with that being said, it's actually Kira Sol. And Judy, tell us a little bit more about what that means and what this concept is about. Kira Sol, Cocina Mexicana is a new concept from Baja Cali. So we've always wanted to do the perfect breakfast burrito. And this has been a dream for Jaime and Lorena for quite, a, quite some time now. And we decided to create an authentic Mexican restaurant that not only serves breakfast, but lunch and dinner, but not quite yet. So right now we're just starting off with breakfast, testing our recipes, seeing what works best um, and what doesn't work. And right now we have two chefs from Mexico that are creating these delicious recipes. And the specialty is actually chilaquiles. I've had it about five times already <laughs> in the last two weeks. I've tried all the different sauces and I really enjoy it. Brilliant, and I can, let me just say this too. I did have a plate um, that's now passed. <laughs> And it was brilliant as well. Um, I had the avocado omelet. Um, again, brilliant food for sure. Tell us a little bit more about this concept, here so being a breakfast idea. Baja Cali is known for, I feel like, lunch and dinner concepts. But this is breakfast. Is it only here in Monrovia, or can people find it elsewhere yeah. at your other branches? Well, so Baja Cali, we're known for our fish tacos. We have nine locations, but Hiraso is only in Monrovia, so it's sort of our one-off, our new business, something completely separate. So our kitchen's separate, our menus are separate, everything's completely different. Okay. How about things that uh, are coming up for Baja Cali within the community? Tell us a little bit more about your, your guys' involvement, maybe um, things that are coming up with holidays. What do you oh. guys have going? Yeah. Well, uh, we just got voted Business of the Year with the Alhambra Chamber of Commerce. So that was pretty exciting. And uh, for the upcoming season, we're gonna do a pumpkin run and, and uh, all of our office people are gonna go and join in and, <laughs> and, and run around in fish taco costumes maybe, if I can convince them to do that. Okay. And for the, um, for the holiday season, we're planning on doing something with Foothill Unity Foundation and I think we might do a water drive and or a food drive. Okay, brilliant. So you definitely have those opportunities within the community to give back, which I think is always an important piece. Um, any fun facts that people should know about? Obviously, we, we broke one being the breakfast piece, but any other things that make Baja Cali stand apart from other sure. places? Well, no one knows this because it's not widely publicized and that will change soon, but Baja Cali is actually owned by a fam it's family owned and the owners are just two people, Jaime and Lorena, and they used to work together in the school district and they decided to open a restaurant with fish tacos. And that was five years ago. Wow. And now we've expanded to nine locations. We have managers at every location and we do a lot of fun activities together. So recently we went to Disneyland. There you go. And I think this is a brilliant chain for the fact that, again, it's California-based. Um, it's such a, on such a local level. Again, their main first branch was in Alhambra, uh -huh. where you just got voted best yeah. company of the year, right? Yeah, business of the year. Best business of the year. And it's just grown organically. And it's grown because people like it. And this branch being the newest, is yes. that realistic, yes. uh, here in Monrovia? And now it's branching out into the breakfast realm. I think it, it's just such a good place to bring your family. It's a place that you can now enjoy, not just in the afternoons and evenings, but now in the mornings. So something that uh, I wanted to make sure I shared with everybody out there on this edition of Local Insiders. So guys, thank you for tuning in. Until next week, this is this week. We'll catch you later. Talk soon.